coming out of this pandemic, healthcare is obviously a top of mind issue for voters now more than ever, perhaps. Does Doug Mastriano have any stances around healthcare that voters, Pennsylvanians like me, should be aware of? Yeah, I mean, obviously, Doug Mastriano does not support your access to affordable health care in a lot of different ways. I mean, Pennsylvania is a state that has good access to health care for low income people and people who might be struggling, especially during this pandemic. But it's incredibly important that we expand that access to folks who are really just struggling during this time. And Mastriano is disinterested in that. Beyond that, he's got some weird beliefs around health care. I mean, okay, Kate. Imagine this, it's the start of the pandemic. It's back to March, 2020. And Doug Mastriano is in the Pennsylvania legislature trying to overturn HIPAA laws so that I believe so that he can get access to knowledge of who has come down with COVID. It's a very weird chapter in Doug Mastriano's professional and political career (laughs) (laughs) because he's a guy, he's so anti-vax, anti-mask. I mean, name a conspiracy theory about COVID and he believes in it. And yet at the start of the pandemic, he was asking us to get rid of HIPAA. It's very weird. He's a weird guy. He's a weird guy and a dangerous guy. Like he's not a joke. These are realistic things that could happen in Pennsylvania if he's the governor. And just because he is this extreme does not mean that those aren't very real threats that could happen right now. 